happening right now in Australia. The calendar has already flipped. This is Sydney celebrating 2016 with their fireworks display. And the skies lit up over Victoria Harbor in Hong Kong at the stroke of midnight to celebrate. Here in northeast Wisconsin, the parties are in full swing as we count down to 2016. And police are watching. The goal to crack down on drunk driving on a night notorious for drinking. NBC 26's Billy Wagness begins our live team coverage in Green Bay, where extra patrols are on the roads. Yeah, Stacy, it's areas like here along Broadway and downtown Green Bay where people are flooding the bars celebrating New Year's Eve that has police paying extra close attention tonight. As the clock draws closer to midnight along Washington Street in Green Bay. We have the bar district, as you can see, to the north and to the south on Washington Street. Lieutenant Jason Allen with the Green Bay Police is just one of many officers. We have extra officers in the area on patrol, specifically looking for impaired motorists. Looking for more signs of drunk driving tonight than just swerving. Running red lights, failing to use signals, not using their headlamps during hours of darkness, running stop signs, varying speed. Beads. Wisconsin's police departments have been warning of tonight's crackdown all week and encouraging people on social media to plan ahead with a sober driver. Get those options out to the safe ride home. Uh, Uber is now available in the Fox Valley. Um, Appleton Cab Companies. If a sober cab falls through, Officer Michael Lambie of the Fox Valley Metro Police Department hopes people will even consider walking home if they're dressed for it. If you're going to be exposed to any uh, elements tonight for any extended period of time, it's always nice to pack extra mittens, gloves. Whatever it takes to keep you from being another New Year's Eve statistic tonight. Now, police are clear that tonight is a zero tolerance policy when it comes to drunk driving. So if you find yourself at a bar and you still don't have that sober ride home lined up, just ask the bartender. It's likely that they have all the contact information you'll need to find that safe ride home. Reporting live in downtown Green Bay, Billy Wagness, NBC 26.